Nick, con esta temática que le caracteriza siempre a ella, como es, pues creo, si no me equivoco, y por lo que he leído, tratas tus hobbies, los transformas en, esta, en estas piezas, por lo que entiendo que uno de tus hobbies es eh, la equitación, los caballos. Además, también de unas bailarinas que haces con movimiento, que ya hemos tenido la oportunidad de disfrutar aquí en Alfas, no solamente en la Casa de Cultura, también en la Fundación Clay, y si no equivoco, en más zonas de la comarca también has expuesto fuera. Ok. Bueno, primero, gracias por la oportunidad de estar aquí. Y gracias también a ella. Ella me ha soportado desde la primera vez, creo. Yo no lo bueno. llamaría soportar, ¿eh? Para mí es un placer Eso. poder estar a tu lado y poder facilitar. Ok, then I'll continue in English. Well, welcome everybody, lovely to see you all. It's a little bit a strange day. We changed the program a little bit, which is, I think, very understandable because horrible things happened in another part of the province. And it didn't feel right to have nice music, even though I love the music Tanya uh, otherwise would have played. So it's, today is not the day to do that. So a bit of a change program, which I'm happy you're all here. And I'd like to explain a little bit about my work. Most artists first make sketches and then they start making sculpture. Okay, this, this would be fine for a drawing. Let her make a drawing. Mm -hmm. For instance, you can see this very well when you look over there, this sculpture. I made this one uh, when I was in, a, in, a, in Holland, in the field. Uh, I was there for a week, just watching the horses, trying to work it out, how all the muscles are, how they move. And this horse was very much bothered by flies, so it was biting all the time, and I was amazed at the flexibility, and I tried to capture that.